SCP-6448 is called Not Deer. This isn't to be confused with SCP-2845, the divine godlike deer creature that is uh, is one of the most powerful entities in the SCP universe. You know, I, uh, I, I, I grew up in South Louisiana. I still live here. And my dad, along with a bunch of my family and friends, are all avid hunters. And deer are one of the things that they enjoy hunting. I never personally liked deer hunting because I thought it was kind of boring. You know, they say it's about the challenge, sitting in a tree stand and just waiting forever for a deer to cross your, your path so that you could shoot him. And it's just, it, it never was really my thing. I like I like quick action packed hunting or fishing. Those were, those were fun to me, like I enjoy duck hunting. But deer hunting has always been kind of boring. And it's usually very, very cold and you can't move much or say anything or whatever. It's, I don't know, it's just not my thing. Now I love eating deer meat, venison is, delicious if you're vegan or you're vegetarian i'm sorry if this offends you but they they are oh my god it's incredible deer meat is 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 wonderful man uh i don't know if anomalous deer meat would taste any good but i would try it on occasion we try stuff like that anyway guys this one is by the rubber look i know that some people have recently been told in my comments some people don't really like the rubber listen i respect all the creators okay i enjoy them for an entertainment perspective and sometimes they don't have to be 100 percent accurate for me to enjoy the content now if you see some inaccuracies feel free to list them in the comments just be respectful okay <laughs> i really appreciate all of you guys if you like the rubber make sure to subscribe to them subscribe to me if you like reaction videos and uh let's get into this one viewer discretion is advised the deer contained within the cell stirred as it regained consciousness from heavy sedation Okay. Cryptozoology specialist Oz stood in front of a large one-way glass window at the side of the room. So they already have Subject it contained. Subject has regained consciousness. Definitely beginning not interview with 6448. The deer suddenly bolted oh. upright and stared at the intercom. It's a weird deer. It stood facing away from the window. It's a biped? Suddenly, its neck swiveled 180 degrees what? with an audible crack, okay, visibly an... breaking multiple vertebrae. Possessed exorcist? Christ almighty, deer? I thought you said this was one way. The deer's gaze remained locked on Oz. Uh -huh. It didn't blink. He sees through the two-way okay. mirror. Okay. <sighs> Are you something imitating deer? The deer opened its mouth, baring its sharp teeth. Its jaw moved in a manner that seemed to imitate speech. As its movement went against how the mouth of a deer usually would, some of the muscle got twisted and torn. However, no intelligible dialect was this uttered. This is straight out of a horror movie, dude. Similar to gagging. It then blinked oh, yeah, for the first time to in the interview. But the movement appeared noticeably forced. The oh deer screamed God. in Oz's distorted voice and collapsed. Its body contorted violently and began writhing. The then it got back up and rammed against the window Gosh. repeatedly. G get the stags in the here now. Hello, everybody. You. I'm the rubber. Today, we bring you SCP Foundation Peter Class <laughs> hey, Object SCP-6448. So SCP-6448, also known as Not Deer, is an anomalous branch of the deer animal. Okay. All members of this group of deer display heightened intelligence and are presumed to be sapient. They're already smart. Most man. specimens exhibit some form of physical malformation, causing them to stand out like from the non-anomalous ones. You While know, the exact like details like of their physical abnormalities differ between instances, commonalities include legs that bend backwards, mm -hmm. bloated abdomen, mm -hmm. emaciation, having eyes belonging oh. to other animals and sometimes humans, oh. forward-facing eyes, oh. jerky movements, <laughs> lack of fear towards like humans, the, the, tendency to walk <laughs> on two hind legs, and general body disfigurements. This this is this is basically like a, a, a possession, like a person that's possessed, right? Like you know these horror movies, how the, the 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 possessed or the demons or whatever they they always have these twitchy movements that are creepy or whatever, and have these multiple voices or whatever. This is what it reminds you. It's like straight out the Exorcist, man. Aside from physical deformations, instances show severe divergence from the behavior of other deer. That, naturally. Namely, six four four eight are known to watch observe and stalk humans stalk. often for hours or days on end like this includes following here? humans to and from their homes wherein they will proceed to steal belongings weapons and food very uh -huh. rarely will they attack victims while they are indoors <laughs> 6448 is most commonly encountered in deep woodlands particularly at night right. or dusk when a person is alone 
any form of direct acknowledgement of 6448's anomalous traits in these situations will always, always result in the victim's termination. Of course. If you they notice a deer too. that just looks off, look away and ignore it. <laughs> if it knows that you've noticed it, then it's too late. Yeah. If you hear your name or whistling or something else in the woods calling for you, don't acknowledge it. They call Never acknowledge you? its existence. Don't respond, don't go looking for it, and don't call out to it. Okay. I if you're walking at night <laughs> and you feel something here, near, 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 near. Neck, don't whispering do that. just Look behind you, demonic, and the hairs bro. on your neck stand up, do not turn around. That vote, you the do voice. not change the pace the in which you're gosh. walking. You continue. You ignore. Like if a bear? on to you, well, you'd better hope it ignores you too. <laughs> Schofield scoffed at the cryptic warning oh on the gosh. fence. Uh, I've been in the foundation for three years. I've seen things from some weird refrigerator to a mighty dragon. <laughs> weird What's a little deer gonna do? He pushed a past little the deer? opening and entered the cabin. I mean, Jackson followed vigilantly behind. No, seriously, this is a waste of time. What the hell are we doing in some woods in the middle of nowhere? Careful, Schofield. A civilian was killed by it, according to the reports. And it uh, wasn't the first time either. And it's We're here to investigate. To the other deer. And if necessary, terminate the <laughs> anomaly. Schofield cocked his rifle and put it on the desk. He then handed his pistol to Jackson. Don't have to tell me what to do. Mm -hmm. This is just like the hunting trip I used to go on with my dad. Here, have my pistol yeah, if you're you so see? scared. Schofield. I'd prefer if you'd take this more seriously. Exactly. Schofield We're not hunting the deer. And We're hunting the surroundings. an anomaly. He could see some take woodland this seriously, critters Schofield. and some deer in the distance. <laughs> well, I guess this is a nice change of scenery. I'm due for a break anyway. <sighs> look, I've brought some incident reports with us. Just look through them if you have the time. Right. Yeah, yeah. You don't want to get a briefing or nothing? Nothing happened during dude. the first few nights. However, on the fifth day, the cabin had a break-in. They watched the footage of the surveillance camera and saw a deer smashing through the door. It looked around at first and then at the camera. <laughs> it stood up on its hind legs and reached towards the camera. Its frontal hooves had been warped to resemble fingers. Wow. We slept through all of that? How did we not hear the door? Exactly. I'll stay up and keep watch tonight. Man, I'll wake Rest up with easy, my wife forts. If I see that thing, <laughs> I'll make sure that it's dead. That night, Schofield heard his name being you called I mean. faintly from outside the cabin. It was like a scream in a voice oh, he didn't recognize. Time, he grabbed his rifle it's and ran out immediately. Right. Come on out now. Two. Enough games. I know your tricks, and it won't fool me. He's got an assault he saw rifle. A deer, noticeably larger, standing still among the bushes hunting, under the moonlight. <laughs> he fired a shot in its direction it's and duty. missed. Damn it! He loaded the next round and took aim. You fired but from the, the deer hip. Was that's already why. Gone. Jackson came running behind him. Schofield, it. what are you doing out here? Oh, what's going on? I saw the deer. Probably scared it away, though. If I see it again, I'll... So why is he Let's blasting go. it, too? Is As he they turned to an leave, agent? Jackson glanced at the woods and shuddered when he saw two eyes glowing in the dark, staring the at them. <laughs> the next day, Schofield woke up to find Jackson missing. He looked out the cabin, and it started raining. Probably went out to retrieve the camera took my rifle too. Bored, he recalled Jackson mentioning the case reports. He opened the envelope and found a tape inside. It gone. was a recorded footage taken by a woman. Got the video began with a woman rustling the camera. Visibly shaken, she struggled to set it up on the table. Schofield paused and looked around the cabin. Wait a minute, is that this here? Cabin? The woman jumped when she heard a knock on the door. She slowly moved further away from it as the, the knocking, deer knocking on the door. The handle was being jostled and shaken incessantly. Yeah, you see, that's the deal. But this is a horror side movie. This is not a deer. Phrase, Hello, it is me. Hello, let me in. In a calm manner, as the door shook, the woman then grabbed a gun and retreated to the wardrobe. The What's knocking going on? ceased, and footsteps could be heard becoming further away. That's not a deer. That's a dude. Shortly after. Sound Wait. of galloping was audible oh. as a deer busted in through the door. Oh! It's they jaw talk moved too, and though? repeated the phrase once more. Hello, it is me. They can Hello, talk Hello, let me voices. in. The deer stood on its hind legs. Its movements were That's crooked so and creepy, stiff. Dude. Then it slouched down to a quadrupeded position like a spider oh and surveyed God. the cabin. It inhaled heavily, 
and suddenly its head locked in on the direction of the wardrobe that the woman had taken it's refuge an animal, in. So it could smell, it right? scampered towards the wardrobe and forcefully opened it. The woman screamed and fired a single shot that was immediately pummeled to death by the abomination. Gosh. Pummeled the or entity antler. remained still for a moment, then looked towards the camera. Oh my god, are those human eyes? Schofield slowly walked towards the wardrobe and opened it, but it had already been cleaned before they got there. Huh. Just then, he received a mail on his tablet. Okay. It was yet another footage sent by the Foundation. The message read, Just so you know what you're dealing with there, stay vigilant and good luck. The footage began with Researcher Oz conducting an interview with what looked like a deer in a containment cell. Gosh. Schofield became is there increasingly multiple irate as the interview the went on. One? What do you mean, know what you're dealing with? <laughs> it's a deer! A no, deer! It's an so anomaly! So what if it can stand up and it crawl around like, like, a, like a spider? It's nothing but a deer! Suddenly, a How mass of black get viscous tendrils erupted out of the now deer's it's a sides. Beast. It leaped and squirmed around the cell before shattering the window. It's a hentai the deer. remaining carcass was left entirely hollow. The black mass maneuvered swiftly out of the facility and disappeared uh, into the outside shrubbery, wounding and killing shrubbery. multiple Foundation personnel along the way. What the hell is this thing? Exactly! No, Jackson. Schofield, Schofield grabbed the pistol and rushed Jackson out of the did. cabin. Jackson! Jackson! Where are you? Answer me! He did! Schofield called as he ventured deeper into the woods. Soon enough, his surroundings became darker as the this vegetation man needs got to get denser. Beard. He could feel that something was stalking uh -huh. him watching him. Suddenly, he heard a voice calling his name. Schofield! Schofield! The voice repeated. Though distorted Say, and faint, he could discern that it was trying to imitate Jackson's voice. Uh. Damn you! Stop messing with me and come out. He heard thumping sounds and sure? leaves rustling from afar. <laughs> you sure you wanted to come Closing out? in on the sound, he finally found the source. A bloody deer with forward bending legs and covered in viscera, running clumsily and ramming against a tree with incredible force. Over and over They're again. Deer kind of do that to mark your territory. The tree was a mangled up body of a man. <gasps> Schofield recognized the uniform. It was Jackson's. What the hell? The not Told deer you, noticed dead. Schofield and turned its attention towards him jerkily. Now you did. To take this, die, die. Schofield unloaded his pistol and shot down the not deer. Can we get an MTF on here? Still writhed and shrieked in pain. As he turned to run, the entity lunged at him and pinned him down. Its deformed hooves pounded repeatedly on Schofield. Ah! He tried to defend himself He's against its onslaught, but couldn't. Suddenly, a mass of tendrils burst through its oh, abdomen you and continued to, get, you to got ravage him. Schofield stopped struggling. He was left barely breathing as the tendrils slowly oh. tightened their grip around his body. Days later, their bodies were recovered in an unrecognizable state next to a hollowed-out deer skin. No traces of the tendrils were hollowed found. Out? Remember to check out- Wait, 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 this thing, this thing is a skinwalker? <laughs> what? <laughs> now you see, this was entertaining, was it not? I, I don't know about the accuracy of these things because it's a reaction channel, right? I don't, I don't read into them prior to this. There's a bunch of holes in what happened. First of all, I don't know how this dude got hired as an SCP agent at all. Like, he didn't seem, he seemed like some old, just some dude that they just, that knew how to use a gun, like an ex-cop almost. You know what I mean? Like oblivious to what in the heck is going on. Oh, I, <laughs> I enjoy tales like this though, cause we could cut up and we found out a little bit about a very, interesting anomaly <laughs> that might may or may not taste good and anyway right, guys make sure to subscribe to the rubber subscribe to me if you like reaction videos too thanks so much for watching as always this is the little inside and off we'll see you next time